not in what you're claiming yeah. at all. Yeah. <laughs> so, so, but that, and then to get to, to today, I agree. I think it's, it's a total different norm. We're, we're in a new space, a new time. This is a total shakeup. I, I, I tell, I, you know, I, I put um, down um, when, when, when asked, how do I want to be looked at? I put disruptor. I'm yeah. a disruptor. Um, yeah. I believe people uh, are caught up in spaces or, or we're caught up into our ways of things. We're, yeah. we're caught up in the habit of whatever. We're caught up in the, the way of whatever. And I don't, I believe that's man's way of finding ways to being comfortable with this thing called reality. You know, from my perspective, and and I, I don't choose to see things the way. People, so this lonely time, yeah. for, for for most out there that that haven't been living, I believe in a an appropriate way, a, a, a way that's more wholesome and conducive yeah. to life. Yeah. They're they they're like this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah. Right. Whereas me and my family, we're we're comfortable. Like like. You know, unfortunately, like, I'm working from home now, I get, but I get to still work. I still get to bring in a check. Yeah. I'm trying to do like you have said, which is so powerful. And I have been before you even said it, but I'm trying to become an owner. Yeah. I'm not trying to work for somebody. Yeah. It just takes a little bit to get something started yeah. sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. And I've been in my process. And this has been a short process of a start, but yeah. I'm in my process. That's what matters. So, 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 so I agree with uh, uh, you that this time is shaking. It's a, it's a time that's going to shake a lot of people up. But I think it's, it's, it's a time that's shaking people up that um, we're living in this fictitious idea where we, we, our mind projects a lot onto this thing called reality. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then we start to believe what our mind's information is telling us, opposed, much like you're saying, mm -hmm. dealing with reality. Mm -hmm. People want to deal with their mind's idea of the reality. And that's a scary and that's thing. Where the, and that's, right, and that's, that's where the scary. problem comes in. That's how people panic. That's how right. the person who's being saved from drowning, yes, you know, is it starts drowning the person who saved them right. because they're panicking. You know yes, what sir. I mean? It's yes, like you're, but you can't swim as it is. <laughs> like you're being saved by somebody who can't. And so I've seen like lifeguard movies where they knock the person out right. and then save them. You right. Know? Because, <laughs> because they're gonna get killed because you're gonna I'm drag them you under because you, you you're just in panic right. and, and panic obviously and fear. Um, you know, it's, it's never a helpful thing. I mean, it, it, that's the main reason why God has not given that to his children. God has not given you a spirit of fear, but of power and love and right. a sound mind. A sound mind. When you're in fear, you don't have a sound mind. Right. And so you, right. you know, you're damaging, you're threat. Now you become the threat because you're in fear. Right. You just right. amplified the fear and you right. amplified the threat because you're in fear. Well, go ahead, my man. I know you had something you were trying to get off your chest. Thanks for checking out a clip from one of our When Iron Shoppings Iron podcast episodes. Click the link below for the full video. It gets deep.